Vietnam veteran is honoring prisoners of war 45 years after he served. News 8's Lancaster reporter Meredith Jurgensen visited his unique vigil. Okay. In the shadow of Lancaster's Christmas tree, there's a bamboo cage. All right. Okay. That looks good. And a man who will stay in that cage. Here I go. Lewis Alston does this each year to raise awareness for POWs and MIAs in Vietnam. Okay. And he stays here for a while. 24 hours. He constructs this cage with great care to show people what being a prisoner in Vietnam was like. It's tangible. Different ones will come up and they'll touch the bamboo and, and they'll see what it looks like. I think about what our POWs went through when, when they were at Hanoi Hilton. They went through a lot worse than this. And so I need to be able to stand tall and be here for them. It's not comfortable, especially with temperatures below freezing. I'm just going to have to grip my teeth and bear with it. But this Marine Corvette hopes he brings comfort to others. All right, thanks for serving. Welcome home, brother. A lot of veterans come down a lot. You know, that's what I like. They'll come down and they'll, you know, share a sandwich or a cup of coffee. So they look out for me pretty much down here because they appreciate what I do. Penn Square is an appropriate spot for the vigil. Lou set up in front of Lancaster's Soldiers and Sailors Monument, right in front of the Vietnam plaque. Honored. I feel real honored to be able to do this. In Lancaster, Meredith Jorgensen, News 8. According to the U.S. military, there are still more than 1,000 servicemen listed as missing in action from the Vietnam War, six from the most current Iraq. Nearly 8,000 are still MIA from the Korean War, and over 73,000 are listed as MIA from World War II.